Man walks into a doctor's office. Says no one ever talks to me. Doctor says, Snakes? Now I've seen everything. Hey, how many salesmen does it take to screw on a light bulb? How many, oh great ones? Two. One's the screw in the bulb, and the other one's the right up the order for the vacuum cleaner. <laughs> That's not funny. I know comedy, and that's not funny. Jokes? Really, big work, Charles. Jokes? He <laughs> call those jokes? He wouldn't even get a gig at the plantation. And those lunatics feed him his lines. I guess that's why they're called the, the Straight Man. Hold on! You're not funny. Now put me down. Hey, I don't have a handle hecklers like you. What a scoop. This is the greatest story in the history of WREP Radio. I gotta get this guy on the air. On the air? That's peanuts. We gotta get him back to Rep City. He'll be the biggest act in the known universe. Think of the ticket sales. Think of the guest appearance fees. Think of the merchandising. There's no end to it. Think of the food bills. Hey, what do you know about comedy? I run a cabaret, and I wouldn't hire you if you were the last comedian on earth. <laughs> Whoa, Baba, look at the size of that thing. Oh, what is it? Well, it ain't the tooth fairy. Whatever it is, it's got Myrna. We're going in. <laughs> of the century. Not only did we unearth really big foot, but the beast has a comedy act. Well, that thing almost killed Myrna. Especially with that last punchline. You wouldn't want me to tell a billion Rap City residents the T-Rex were obstructing the biggest story of the century. <gasps> would you? Yeah, well, you wouldn't happen to be threatening us. <laughs> would you? Unfortunately, Waldo here is right. We got a duty to show this thing to the rest of the world. What? He's a primitive and destructive jungle creature, Bugsy. He has no place in the city. Yeah, he'll wreck the place. The mayor will have to increase taxes to strengthen all the bridges. Well, this is not a smart idea, Bugsy. But it, boys. We're taking him to Rep City. Mr. Huge, we'll help you load really big foot aboard your plane. And make repairs and escort you back to the city. Hey, Bugsy, I hope you know what you're doing. So do I, Bruno. So do I. Papa, release mooring rope. Mooring rope, release. This is a really big mistake. That thing is gonna ruin Rep City. I'm not worried about Rep City. It's a rag that's in danger. <laughs> Goodbye, Murray. We'll miss you. <laughs> It's just like my great-great-grandfather said. <laughs> Have you seen my prune juice? Hey, 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 where am I? Relax, big boy. Calm down. You? Hey, listen, I'm sorry I got angry with you back there. Hey, where's my audience? Where are my straight men? Just take it easy, kid. Soon you'll have a bigger audience than you ever had before. Just relax and enjoy the trip. Gee, you're awfully nice. Can you stay here for a while? Sure. On one condition. Don't tell any jokes. Introduce the funniest 
a sprint with the biggest feet. Really big for it. Oh, we never had such a crowd. Hopefully he'll bomb and we can take him back where he came from. Man walks into a doctor's office, says no one ever takes any notice of me. The doctor says, next. Okay, how many golfers does it take to move an audience? Four! <laughs> this is terrible! <laughs> Thank goodness. What kind of an audience are you anyway? This is funny stuff! You're supposed to laugh! Why aren't you laughing? Because you're not funny! I'll show you not funny! I don't get it. Why aren't they laughing? Because you're not funny, Murray. Have you ever considered some new material? A few good gags? Hey, I don't need a new act. I'll show them. I don't believe it. He's got murder. Boys, we got some changing to do. Better than motion sickness. Smarter than my agent. A good way to keep our day job. Okay, boys, hit it. Climbing this building. I don't know, but I saw in the movie once. Get your coolers ready, boys, but be careful. He's got Myrna, and it's a long way down. I don't want you to get hurt. Don't go anywhere. What do you think? I'm gonna call a taxi? <laughs> I hope really Bigfoot can find his way home. Aye, and it was beauty that killed the beast. No, it wasn't. It was bad timing. That'll kill any comedian. the old guy. We'll never laugh again. It reminds me of something my great-great-grandfather. Hi, honeys. I'm home. Murray, you've returned to us. We're all together again. Murray, 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 Murray. Hey, 
How many reptiles does it take to defeat Murray? How many? 